Greetings, my subjects, and welcome to what should be one of the last episodes of me playing Dark Souls, the Ring City DLC. Now, as I said on the walkthrough, I wanted to know how much farther I had, because I was curious, mostly for the episodes. If it were just me, I probably would have just, I would have been stuck a while ago, probably. Not because uh, I needed a walkthrough, just because, man. Or actually, I probably would have beaten this by now, because I, because I happened to do this while you guys were watching, I didn't want to progress because I didn't want the episodes to go away, you know? Because I'm having fun doing this for YouTubes. But what I have learned so far is that this is the final actual boss fight. And then after this, there is a final, uh... There is one more dark spirit to fight. So, we're gonna wait for this guy to come in. Okay. Okay, Sadi. Satai. Satai. Are there any more? I'd like at least one more, but I will take what I can get, because I am happy to have this turtle guy aboard. Or now he's just using a face wrap. Ah, there he is. Any more? Ah, let me wave. I'm gonna wave to you, friend. Hi. Hey. Oh, that. I don't have that. Buy my sword. Okay. Ah. I gotta do that one real quick, and then I guess I'm gonna fight it with this guy. Okay, off we go. I'm comfortable with this number of people. I don't know what that symbol next to his name means. Wow, starting me off right as soon as we get in there. Even though he's just, yep, he's clamoring towards me. Look at that guy go. What does this say? God ahead. That's a little, uh, that's a little much. That's a lot. Haha, he has aggroed my friends to die. Haha, continue to aggro my warrior of light. Come on, I gotta stab you in the butt. I got some sweet delicious butt stabs in there. Man, he was not ready for that butt stabbing. Okay, now that's where I heal. Okay, cool. So it's hard to believe this was the guy all along that was telling me to continue forward. I don't know what his objective was. Okay, this guy appears to be using a stronger weapon now. Well, that was close. Wow, Satai needs to use, uh, Anestis. Whoa. Wait, I know it's coming. He got really far away. Oh, no, 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 no! 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 Okay, I'm just gonna chug two of these. Dude. Dude. Damn it. Oh, you can never rely on these people. Only May. May, where'd you go? Oh, fuck you. Fuck you and all that you stand for, slave die dog. No! Oh, wow. I totally should have gotten hit by that. Just like that. Nope. Newt. 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 Stop it! Ow! Stop. Owie, that I can't take a moment to heal and hit you at the same time. Oh, hey, I got him halfway. I, mean, I suppose he is a pretty decrepit old man at this point. He is not the slave knight he used to be. Is that blood dripping from his head or his mouth? It looks like it's coming directly from his forehead. That is a pretty messed up sword. Oh, is this blood? 
You did not know you had blood? The blood of the dark soul. That is your blood, sir. You have the dark soul. What? What changed? Just think you can be tough because you slather blood all over your sword? Is that it? Is that what you think? I'm not okay with this. I thought we had a fun dynamic earlier on. Then you had to go and do this. You wrecked. How highly I thought of you. What happened to your sword? <laughs> well, oh hey, that thing. I forgot all about this thing. Okay, I don't like that you're walking on two feet instead of... F oh, fuck your dad's ah, ah, ah. Woof. Bow wow, woof. Oh, hey. Wait, this is dangerous! Stop it with the damn crossbow! Oh, God. They were boomerangs. Oh, how is this? How is this? I'm dead. Oh, I'm I was alive. <laughs> oh, I got his health a third of the way, right around. And that was with the help of a guy. Lord. Well, here goes another ember. Oh, bloosh. Okay. Here I, here I sit until I see a thing. Okay, don't mind me. I'm just gonna kind of wait. Uh, let's yeah, let's move this one. All right, this is where I sit and wait. Don't mind me. I'll be back as soon as you know someone appears, cause I cannot do this alone. I, mean, I probably could, but it would take hours. Ah, yes, Mini-Me! Come join the party! I am not doing this with at least, without at least two people. So I'm hoping that there's gonna be another thing coming. Like another, uh, summon sign available. Oh, hey look, dude guy. I'm gonna show you Legion etiquette. Did you just... Oh, he dropped the hello stone. I'm gonna wave. I don't have that thing. I want that thing. I don't have that thing. Okay. <sighs> I'm, we're just gonna have to wait for another guy. I'm sorry. Oh, hey. I mean, if many, 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 if you think you, we can do it. You know what? I believe in this guy. I'm just gonna just take another double check. Okay, there's no one. Oh god, he has become dragon. Well. Ah! All right. <laughs> this guy. A lot of bloodstone, just uh, blood stains in here. Looks like he's gonna wait. So now we prostrate ourselves while I continue to wait for another thing at least. Come on. Please, I don't want to keep this guy waiting. That's an inconvenience to his life. I don't know what those symbols around his uh, thing are. Like the coins and the face. Alright. We've waited long enough. I don't feel like making this guy wait. How nice. Here. Let me show you my thanks. Ah! Oh! There's no one out here. Not a soul. Not a spirit in sight. He's pointing down in a circle. Touch the blood stain. 
Did this guy just die here? Ah, yes! Blue! Perfect. Ah. Ah, oh, there was a gold one here. I guess that's okay. Perfect. That guy's wearing thorn armor. I don't even have that. Yes! And there's no one else to gather towards me. I, th I am okay with this. Uh, my thanks. Alright. I am content with these two guys. That is enough for me. Off we go. On another adventure. Okay. Let's do this. Let's dig you dig do this. Let's fucking go! Alright, dudes. I believe in you and me and every power we have. Oh god, he is coming. He is like a dog. Bark, bark. Oh. How did I not get hit in that? There we go. There's some damage. Okay, so he's an archer. So it's very effective for him that me and this guy are here. Okay, I'm just going to do this before I go back in. Oh god, he's targeted that guy. No! <laughs> Mini me, no! Oh boy, he's surrounded in poison. Hey, no. Aggro me. I have the highest health here, probably. Okay. We have just encountered... Oh, I can't die. I I cannot afford to die. No, this is hot. This is awesome. Okay. Okay, cool. I'm gonna just enjoy this for a second. I'm gonna give them a chance to breathe. You know. Before we have to encounter this bullshit. Yeah, whatever. I'm over it. So you had it all along. Why did you need to kill everybody, guy? Damn it, Gale. He's got a really cool design, I will admit that. Just all gray and decrepit and shit. I'd, I need to learn a little bit more about the lore of this game, because I'm not even sure this game knows the lore of this game, you know? You feel me on that? Because I think that's the whole Dark Souls series as a whole. Oh, hey, my souls. I, cold I always forget about those. Alright, guys. Oh, fuck. Ha! Nice. Yeah. Oh, God. I'm coming, guy. That's dangerous. That's damn dangerous. Oh, I think Mini Me ran out of views. <laughs> ah. See, this is great because if I died, that's the end of the whole shebang. Oh gosh. Oh boy, oh boy. Boy, howdy. Oh god, no. Okay, I should have followed their lead. I should have followed their lead. Oh my god. Oh lord. Oh lightning. Oh my gosh. I'm coming, guys. I'm gonna help. Meow. 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 I'm a cat. I'm an agile cat. Meow. Where'd he go? Where, where, where'd he go? Who is this Hasura? Oh, mini me. Seuss, Seuss, and Seuss. 
I am the masseuse. Tighten the noose. Crush the goose. Shut the caboose. I cannot see with all this purple mist. Okay, that's an AoE attack, if I've ever seen one. Oh, blue. Oh, blue. He is attacking you with red. At least a shade of which. Oh, God. Not many me. We are so close. Oh, God. His whole target is mini me. Oh, God, no! I called the final blow! Okay, I think it was one of them, though, is the thing. <laughs> Holy crap. We got the blood of the Dark Soul. My fucking thank you. Uh, these guys. Oh, uh, they're gone now. That was so nice. Oh, no. Ah, uh, there he goes. <sighs> See that? This episode, I finished the boss. So in such a short amount of time. Victory, but regret. Fine work. Okay, so we're gonna rest at this biz, biz bonfire. And there's one more thing that, well, two technically more things I wanna do. First, because I'm a cautious bitch, I'm gonna go back to the bonfire. Well, I'm gonna go back to the Firelink Shrine, and then I'm gonna go level up. After that, I have one Dark Spirit I wish to encounter, and then there's an Ashes I have to go acquire. And then after that, I can say I've done pretty much everything in the Dark Souls DLC. There's a couple of puzzles I probably missed somewhere along the lines, but I have fought every single boss in this run. Level up! Uh, and I don't think I have any, uh... Well, actually, no, I have something I can spend. I know I can spend 9,000 at least on something from her. Purchase. Perch ass. Yeah, some ordained trousers. Look at me. Oh, wow. I didn't even know about these things. Is that a great... Oh, it's a great arrow. I already have Wolner's crown. Uh, maybe something from you. You got a thing for me? Ah, it's good, wasn't he? Reinforce? Ah, uh, no. Uh, no, nothing needs repaired, because for some reason my stuff just never gets damaged. Oh well, whatever. That's a good amount of uh, souls, but not a great amount of souls. I'll, I'll live. Okay, so let me get back to where I was. Okay, now I don't know where this is, but there is one more dark spirit I have to encounter, and I just have to encounter her in the middle of the world. I, I remember her name, too. It's, uh... Shira. Remember that chick that helped me, like, not, not May, but the other girl that helped me out whenever I was doing the, uh, fight with Dark Eater Madir? Yeah, that was, uh, Shira the something of the Philomore. So, it's in a room somewhere? I may need to look this up. Okay, so I need to go parallel with where I came in. Into the wastes. I guess I'll just go into the waste. So I need to find a church or a chapel, something like that. Oh, that I think that's it. I don't actually know, but it looks like it. The constant ruminated question I have running around this landscape is what the fuck happened? Okay, this is obviously where it's at. The blood stains make it clear as day. Unless this is... No, this is where I ran into Gale at. This is where, like, it came out. And there's Gale. So maybe just out this way. Yeah. I think it's down there. Okay. Adventure! Looking around some wastelands. Who knows if I would have found this on my own. Be wary of Oddball. I 
I've searched for thee, the dark, stricken creature. There you are. Shira, daughter of the Duke, descendant of gods, and trusted friend to Medea. I am the honor of the gods, the glory of fire, and the fear of the dark. Thou shalt not go unpunished. But, I but wait. Wait a minute. You helped kill Dark Eater Medea with me. Yeah, you're Shira, the Knight of the Philomore. I don't understand. Oh, oh, oh. That's painful. Oh, hey, you have Estus too? Wow. Okay, that, yeah, that doesn't make any sense to me. I want that arrow scale. I feel like I have it, but like I can't use it because, you know, all melee build. What the fuck is that? Oh, hey, you drink Est Estus too? Man, we have so much in common. We should be friends. We should not fight. I, I actually, this is a neat little tidbit. I'm glad I encountered this. Some would say I use too much Estus. I say, you can never use enough. It's weird for a knight to use such a strange weapon. I just that's just my opinion. Okay. Ow, my ears. My fucking ears. All out of Estus, oh, but I'm not. Now I am. Oh, you timed that so well. Okay. Thankfully, I was able to out Estus her. I mean, you're the one who helped me fight the dragon in the first place. Crucifix of man. Or of the Mad King. That's what that is. Well, I want to look. That's a cool ass weapon. And the name's also really. Uh, also, I just want to acknowledge this thing for a second and how ridiculous it is. Look at this. Look at this. Who would. Who in their right mind would use this damn weapon set? Not I, sir. Not I. Uh, I want to look at the Crucifix thing. I have so many weapons. Uh. Where is it? I saw, I saw it in here. I know I probably did. Probably. Yeah, I guess not. Yeah, I, I don't know where it is. I just have these crow talons. Oh, no. Hiya! Hiya! Okay, enough of that. <laughs> okay. Drop those. Give me back my main weapon set. Okay. So there's one more thing I gotta go do. Now I'm all the way done with what I want to do as far as doing YouTube videos on Dark Souls. For now. So I'm gonna run back to that bonfire. Fast forward time, my favorite time. Gonna miss it. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, it hurts. Everywhere hurts. Okay, cool. Okay, so back to Firelink. Well, there's... Ah, shit. Uh, I'll, yeah, I need to actually go back to Firelink. Well, no, no, I don't need to go back to Firelink. Although it's cool that I did. <laughs> well, because I need to give someone... Well, I can do that first. And then I'll go back and get the other thing. Yeah, you know what? I want to do it all once. Okay, so I've been told that if I travel to the very first area that you go to, the Mausoleum Outlook, 
then you will encounter the lady that you find whenever you first go there, dead. Don't know why, it doesn't explained in the walkthrough that I looked at, but she's dead and you can take her ashes. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. Here it is. This is where I wanted to be. So, yep. Did I ruin? No, no. But I pick it up. The old woman has died. So, on that note, I'm just going to go ahead and use this and return to the Shrine Bonfire. I am completely done with the DLC. I have fought all the bosses. I even went out of my way to fight Dark Eater Mid Midir. Which really confuses me while the while the Fillmore Knight, Shira there, was uh, why she wanted to kill me after the fact, even though she assisted me in the fight to kill Midir. I really need to read up on the uh, lore of this game, because I do love it to death. Okay, I don't have enough to level up, but it, the ashes you give to this lady here. I'm going to see what it gives me. Umbral Ashes. Old Woman's Ashes. Passing and awfully warm at that. Almost as if it had lived mere moments ago. Wow. Oh, forgive an old woman's idle prick. You too are an old woman. I'm sure an ashen one such as thee would never indulge such base contrivances. No? <laughs> now what are you going to give me for it? It's a true question. Not soul arrow. I feel like I've had those things for a while. Not a torch. Or it wouldn't be the canvas thing. Uh, it wouldn't be this. It's normally clothing. What did it add? I'm confused. I don't know what it could have added. Yeah, I'm totally at a loss. I mean, I know that you give it to her. Ashen one. <laughs> okay, whatever. And now I got one more thing I want to do for funsies. I want to know what achievements I missed in this game. Because, I mean, I played it to completion. Ah, yes, his name was Ludlith all along. Okay. Uh -huh. Aha. Okay, ben, begin this. What can I make? So I can make Gale's Greatsword. Let's go ahead and read that. Great sword of uh, Slave Knight Gale, the only weapon that he kept with him from beginning to end. Originally an executioner's sword made for decapitation. This blade is heavily chipped and stained with the blood of countless battles. And it's got a scale. Perca uh, blade apparel. Uh, whatever. Uh, and then the repeating crossbow. This crossbow, customized for repeating repeat firing to face mobs alone, was uh, wielded by a Slave Knight Gale. Used in battles with, the ca with an endless journey... This crossbow is covered with twists and dings, rusted with blood, and made extremely brittle from overuse. I can see that. It looks pretty rickety. Now, seeing as I am not at all a ranged guy, I just kind of want the greatsword. I wish you could do two at once, but that's where it kind of gets you. Because it's like, oh, you got that thing? Well, your chance to get the other thing is, you gotta run through the game again. Now, now. Do not be away. I will be away forever, actually. So, to the best of my knowledge, that is everything that I can possibly do in the Ring DLC. I'm sure there's side stuff I could do, like go do puzzles and stuff, but as far as the, well, air quotes, story of the game, I've beaten the bosses and I've gone through all the areas, like the big known areas. And I did what I could along the way. So I'll trust that you believe me on that. So, on that note... Thank you guys so much for sharing me in this experience. I love Dark Souls to death, and I'm glad I managed to get through the whole game. Because th this is it for me. I mean, and I even, honestly, I kind of feel bad because I had to, uh, you know, get help, outside help. Because all the way up until that last boss, the last boss of Ashes of Ariandel, the last DLC, I had fought every single boss completely alone. Even the hardest one in the game, I don't know if it's factoring in the DLCs, like, prior to the DLCs, I beat, uh, what was it again, the, the king, uh, the dragon king, the fall, whatever his name was, the fallen king, I, the, the one who, all the gold armor that I wore at first was, uh, hold on, I have it, God knows I have it, mushroom hat, no, that's not it, it's the, it's the golden crown, 
One sec, sorry about this. Ah, this. Yeah. Oh, that was his name, the Nameless King. So, all the way up until the Nameless King, whenever I beat him, I had done every fight, like, unattested. And it was fine and everything. But then I stopped playing the game for a couple months before Ash Ashes Variandel came out. And I mean, I was able to beat the Grave Tender on my own, but I, after that, it just, I could no longer do it. I, I mean, if I was on my own, I would have been completely fine just bashing my head against the boss until eventually I won, because that's how I beat the Nameless King. But I cannot tell you how many countless hours it took, you know? It's ridiculous. But I know for a video, that's kind of annoying to watch, because you just kind of want to see the end. So... As far as my pride goes, I wish I didn't have to call in the friends, but as far as the video goes, I'm very satisfied with the fact that I was able to get it done in such a quick manner. I was very... I'm glad I waited, actually, on this, because uh, it gave more people a chance to get there, because I basically played the game right immediately as soon as the Ring City happened, you know? But anyway, talking aside, that's all I got for you. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. My name's King Zeredrick. And I will see you, my subjects, in the next episode. Goodbye, and my thanks for watching. <laughs>